Hey guys, I hope you're all doing really well. So today I wanted to use my Dyson Airwrap and try out a few of the different attachments on my short hair because I actually haven't used that many with having my short hair. I've just used the sort of barrel brush. So I thought it might be a useful video if you're considering buying the Airwrap or if you just wanna see how it works on shorter hair. I'm very interested to see what it looks like curled with these barrel curls. So let's see how this goes. I've just washed my hair and then I put some of this Coco and Eve Miracle Hair Elixir in and this has a heat protectant in it so it will be nice and protected when using all of this heat and I also find it just makes my hair look incredibly shiny and just really nourished looking. So I'm just going to dry my hair to be about 70% dry and really try and focus it on the roots because I find the tools don't get the roots dry as much as they can because they're just focusing on the length of the hair really. So I'm going to go and try and dry my roots. So this is the barrel brush attachment that I have used before with my short hair and it works really nicely. Um, I'm just going to section my hair a little bit because I find with short hair it's really important to get these very under layers quite nice and curled under um, because then it looks nice and short at the back and when you have your final hair look it doesn't have these long bits at the back. So I'm just going to start drying this in sections on the hottest setting. So this is what my hair looks like when I've dried it with the round brush attachment. I don't tend to go for this look all that often because I generally prefer the straight clean cut look but it does give kind of like vintage vibes and it's very voluminous <laughs> and it is pretty cute. Um, so let me know what you guys think. Next up I'm going to try out the barrel curls. So I'm just going to make my hair a little bit damp again using the Authentic Beauty Concept Enhancing Water. And this is just really good if you want a quick little restyle. So I'm just going to take bigger sections for this one. I'm only going to take two sections. So I'll put up the top. Let's give this a go. I'm using the smallest attachments. This is going to be interesting. Okay, I have no idea how this is going to turn out. Um, I've curled all of it, going backwards, so I'm just going to run my fingers through it. <laughs> I feel like this is a good base for then sort of doing a nice half up to with my hair. Whereas I feel like if it's all down, it looks a little bit sort of old, old lady-ish on me. That looks so much better. Oh, I actually like that now. See, before when it was all down, I didn't like it, but now I like it and it's half up. <laughs> I really haven't used my Dyson much having short hair. Um, obviously it's great for like the general drying process if you want a really smooth look, but maybe I should use it a bit more and get more used to it with my short hair. Um, I just, as I said, have been going for the super straight look recently, but I quite like this sort of half up do thing going on. <laughs> Let's try the final brush attachment. There are two different brushes and I've never actually used this one because it's meant to be like a bit 
less intense smoothing than this one. I'm going to spray a bit more of the enhancing water and then I'm just going to brush down and flip up to try and get this flipped out look. Again, it's one that I feel like I maybe don't suit very well, um, but it's fun to try these things out. And the brush did a really good job of just really quickly flipping it out. I've just popped my hair in a half updo again from that flipped out look. And I think this is probably my favorite actually. I think because of my face shape, I just don't suit like a hair. <laughs> I suit like something a little bit slick back here and then it can have like volume down here. Um, but yeah, this is the best look I think out of all of them. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's very short and sweet probably. Let me know if there's any other types of hair video you want to see from me while I have my short hair because it is growing very quickly. I already have a plan for my next hairstyle. Um, it's not a short one. So I'm gonna try growing this out to about here I think. Um, and then we'll see where I go from there. Yeah, I hope you guys are all having a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.